Hello everybody once again. Welcome back to Knox Asian Recipes. Today, som tam, green papaya salad. So her green papaya, she has garlic, chili, green beans, carrots, cherry tomatoes, key lime, and a little bit of palm sugar, salt, soya sauce, and roasted peanuts. So she likes to cut up the papaya with a knife. Of course, she's going to peel it first. This is a local variety of papaya here in the north of Malaysia. Even though it's green, it's a little bit orange inside. It's not ripe though. And she'll proceed to peel the papaya. And then when she cuts it, she doesn't use a grater. You could if you wanted to make it easier, but the texture is a little bit better if you cut it up like this. It stays a little crisper and crunchier. Okay, so she's finished cutting up her, her papaya. There it is. She'll do one portion at a time, basically, in the mortar and pestle is very common. So for one portion, she'll put in some garlic, some chili, and then she'll pound these with her pesto, get it mashed up quite fine. So she's finished her garlic and chili. She's going to start adding some other flavors. Sweet from palm sugar. You could use brown sugar or any other sugar that you want. Palm sugar is a little less sweet. Pinch of salt and she'll start to combine these ingredients. So she has those combined. She's going to add now her long beans, which she's cut up into pieces, a centimeter and a half or two centimeters. Some carrot, which she also chops and not grates. I think when you chop it, you keep the cells whole so it stays crispier. A little bit of moisture from the soy sauce and then some roasted peanuts. And now she'll combine these ingredients. So her goal here is really just to combine the ingredients, not to really pulverize the vegetables or anything like that. And so she's going to add her cherry tomatoes, getting towards the end here. She's got her sweet in there. She's got her spicy in there, garlic, salt, of course. And now her vegetables, her coarse vegetables have been added and combined with the pestle. And now her soft vegetable. And at the end, of course, lime. This is what she's Missing from the flavors, a little bit of sour from the lime. Nock is using key limes today and she'll leave a bit of rind in there as well. And now she's ready to add her papaya. And this is basically one portion. And this is a very common salad in Northern Malaysia and in Thai culture, you can try many varieties. It's a wonderful dish, very refreshing and opens up your appetite and my wife likes to make it quite spicy. So you can use a spoon to help you stir it around inside the mortar. Now she's going to test it, see if there's anything lacking in here. A little bit more lime juice she's going to add. And then basically this one is going to be ready. Today she's going to be serving it with some raw vegetables here from a uh, local market, a uh, kind of spinach and also some green onions and these small eggplants which you can eat raw and a bit of cabbage. So this is a great combination, very healthy vegan dish of course. In Thailand you'll see people will put shrimp in there. You can add dried shrimp to this one if you don't care if it's vegan dish. And bon appetit, it's wonderful. This is a great one. For a starter, let's dig in. We hope you guys will make this at home. Hope you can get a good quality green papaya. All the other ingredients should be no problem. Be creative and combine with different kinds of raw vegetables. See you next time. Thanks for watching.